Wow. Just wow. OB1 plays. Yes, right. What's up? Oh, All right. OB1 plays. going on everybody how are y'all doing we have some epic 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 nintendo switch news items for you today first give the video a huge huge thumbs up like 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 destroy this video and i do want to announce a giveaway that's right we are going to be giving away on this channel a copy of Mario Strikers Battle League, the upcoming Mario Strikers game for the Switch. I'm going to be giving away a new copy to a lucky Twitter follower and subscriber to my YouTube channel. So two things you have to do, follow me on Twitter, subscribe right here to this main channel on YouTube, and you're in the giveaway. I'll be announcing the giveaway probably a couple days before the game launches. So stay tuned, stay tuned, big things. All right, let's get right to the news. This is pretty big. According to an industry analyst, Pierce Harding Rolls, this is his report to investors. Now, <coughs> I don't just report on any old industry analysts because there's a lot of people that are quote unquote industry analysts. But when dudes are talking to um, investors in the gaming market, that means usually they have some insight and some behind the scenes knowledge that we're not privy to. So this article is coming from BGR.com and it says Ampere is currently forecasting a next-gen Nintendo device to release in 2024, said analyst Pierce Harding Rawls in a note to investors, which um, Video Game Chronicles is reporting on. This is the quote from the article. By the end of that year, Switch, and check this number out, this is crazy. Switch is predicted to have sold through 146 million units bro analysts and investors are predicting estimating by the end of um i think it's going to be 2023 well by the end of 2024 the switch will have sold through 146 million units by the time the Switch 2 launches. Put that in perspective. The best selling console of all time, PlayStation 2, did I think around 150 million, 152 million to be exact. And so by the end of when it's all said and done, like I've been saying all along, the Switch is gonna be the best selling console of all time. All right, it says meaning, it still has the potential, the article continues, to become the best-selling console ever by the end of its lifetime, selling over 150 million, 158 million units and overtaking the PlayStation 2. And so there's this article, according to this industry analyst, in his note to investors, he's saying, the switch, he's pretty much saying, <laughs> hold on to your Nintendo stocks because when it's all said and done the switch can will potentially sell over 158 million units which is insane and so the article is saying switch com switch 2 coming in 2024 and it goes on to say nintendo's not in a rush to announce any new switch consoles to try to come out with anything more powerful because the Switch is still the market leader. Even with the PlayStation 5, Xbox Series X on the market, the Switch, month after month, is the best-selling hardware. And so Nintendo's like, 
why come out with a new hardware and shoot ourselves in the foot so i get it but at the same time as a gamer i do want a more powerful console but nintendo they're very business minded they've been in the gaming industry for 30 plus years they're considered in many um, rights the grandfathers of gaming even though atari started the console popularity nintendo just took it to another level and so that's crazy that's crazy that's crazy but this next news item is even crazier check this out this is a fan-made mod of the legend of zelda breath of the wild in 8k pc modded with ray tracing and all of the bells and whistles of a next gen switch console so if you ever wanted to wonder what breath of the wild would look like on a next gen console this is it right here this is coming courtesy of um digital dreams digital dreams they made this mod on pc it has um i think i think it's 4k i think this video is in 8k uh, on youtube but it's a 4 4k ray tracing um they just really upscaled the graphics on the game and the game looks stunning um if you watch the full video and i just thought this was interesting to, to share but the next news item is even doper is that a word i don't know but sega sega has released all new gameplay footage of sonic origins sonic origins this is going to be a day one buy i was primarily a super nintendo kid no no i was a, i was almost half and half during the 16-bit area to keep it a buck because i had the sega genesis 32a sega cd i was all in on sega and so sonic sonic was dope um, when i was growing up sonic origins all new gameplay can't wait for this game to come out there's going to be two modes an anniversary mode <coughs> widescreen infinite lives or you could go og four by eight i think was the perspective uh, ctr and game over game over game over some of these sonic stages were brutal back in the day but it's going to be a collection of all the best sonic games all in one package can't wait for this game to drop gonna be easy day one by new gameplay is now out on the official um sonic the hedgehog uh sega twitter channel all right next news item fall guys fall guys the party battle royale game has announced they're going free to play free to play so you do not have to shell out any cash to play the game starting june 21st next month the game will be free to play i tell you this before mark the latest mario party online game came out which is lit finding nintendo finally nailed mario party online i was always saying bro this game is what mario party online should have been but nintendo hit the nail right on the head i have no complaints with the new Mario Party game. But this isn't about Mario Party right now. Fall Guys will be free to play. I may try it out. I ain't losing nothing but time because it's going to be free. And the next news item, Overwatch 2. Overwatch 2, which will be releasing for the Nintendo Switch as well, has announced a... An, another event, Overwatch 2 event, a new event will be set for June 16th and uh, there will be detailing on how to get into the next PvP beta. I think the beta right now is just for the PC, uh, for the PC um, gamers, PC version of the game. But this game is on my radar. I think the Overwatch hype has um, gone down. Last time I checked, not a lot of people are even tuning in to the Overwatch 2 streams, so that's not a good sign for your game. But they did nail the Switch um, um, conversion. I might one day hop on the Switch um, Overwatch um, if, any, if anybody even plays it on the Switch. But Overwatch 2, next event coming June 16th. All right, that's it for this video. Remember, 
Mario um, Strikers Battle League giveaway. Make sure you're subscribed and follow me on Twitter to get in the giveaway. Uh, it's going to be lit. All right, dudes, what do you guys think about everything we talked about in this video? Sound off in the comment section below. I want to know. But before you go, bro, click that subscribe button. Stay up to date. All things Nintendo. We out, boy. Thank you.